you know, in his own pocket in 2007. If that doesn't tell us that, you know, the system can work and work really well for people who want to ask tough questions, I mean, he should be the one that, you know, everyone is taking um, lessons from. And so, I mean, it's all there. I just, we, just, we just have declined to, to, to take that advantage. All right. My, my favorite uh, piece in this, uh, in this collection has got to be the pitch man, Ron Popeil, yes. and the conquest of the American kitchen. So I'm going to ask you as your final, uh, final question, yeah. what is the great, broad, generalizable uh, lesson, observation about human nature? All I remember is the piece was just, just fascinating. The guy yeah. was fascinating. But is there some larger point here? Well, he, the larger point is that, you know, Ron Popeil made tell the... Tell who he was. Yeah. Ron Popeil is the, is the, he is the kitchen gadget inventor and pitchman who comes from a long family of kitchen gadget guys and he's the guy who did his family did the pocket fisherman and the and the the slice o matic and the chop o matic and Ron famously did um, the Showtime rotisserie and which I believe and many others agree is the greatest rotisserie ever made and you have to understand he sold billions of dollars of Showtime rotisseries not millions billions on those late night infomercials that everyone made fun of. He may be one of the most successful marketers in the history of marketing, in addition to being a great inventor. And the take home lesson is that he is one of the first to realize, and one of the only people to continue to realize, that if you want to sell a transformative product, you have to take the time to explain it properly. Those infomercials are marvels of kind of explanatory clarity and um, uh, um, and persuasion. I mean, they take 15, he takes 15 minutes to show you how a rotisserie oven works. Has, did the people who made VCRs ever take more than 15 seconds to explain how a VCR worked? I mean, no one does this, right? He is proof that if you can be, if you can simply make your case plainly and simply um, to the public, you can win, right? A lesson we seem to have forgotten. So what Ron Popeil does for rotisserie ovens, Malcolm Gladwell does for books. I should be so lucky. <laughs> Thank you, Malcolm. And we will be back.